Jemberu was busy in studio putting final touches on his album before its release. He says that Esatuse is a reflection of the diverse influences that have shaped his sound and the creative vision for Ethiopia's evolving music industry. My music I make it, uh, you know, I like to make fusion. I call it tonic fusion. So I, I kind of, you know, find different uh, aspects of modern music that I like. And then I try to combine those. For example, uh, I'm currently like working on a track called Leila. And it's like this Jersey Club beat mixed with like some uh, Ethiopian Amharic rapping with a little bit of also a little bit of trap and also a little bit of, uh, I would say, sampling going on. So it's like, you know, it's like different elements going in at once and creating this like cohesive vibe. I'm in the zone like, what, what? Koi, koi, koi. Kasatusa is like my uh, character that I've created and it ha it's like the album that I've created around that has its own meaning, its own voice, and its own, you know, outlook, visuals, and it's part of like this greater journey I call Salion, which is like a bunch of characters that I have that I interchangeably I'm going to define and show to the audience, and I'm going to also use this to, to like, you know, say that we are not all people think we are, you know, we could redefine things and we can like push those limits and boundaries in music and in expression. So that's what this album is about. It's about beginning that journey. Jemberu's journey into music began behind the scenes as a producer. The self-described computer geek was fascinated by the technical aspects of music production. This background has heavily influenced his approach to creating music where meticulous attention to detail and the deep understanding of sound engineering play crucial roles. Hadn't I been, been a producer, I would actually start singing or rapping. So, uh, you know, once when I started producing, it was because, you know, I'm a, I'm a computer geek, you know, kind of guy. So every time I'm on a computer, I want to check out the next new app or, like, what's popping. And, you know, I come across these uh, applications. I come across this app called Fruity Loops or FL Studio. And, you know... I'm dabbling with some beats now, and I have a few beats on uh, on like my computer, and I don't know any like musicians, and I'm like, oh, what am I gonna do with these beats? And that's when I was like, okay, you know what? Let me just try, you know, let's try some bars, let's try some rapping, and you know that led to me actually getting immersed and starting to make music for real. Beru's new sonic experimentation represents the evolving landscape of Ethiopian music. By incorporating Amharic raps with the rhythmic and melodic elements of trap music, plus other contemporary genres, he creates a sound that is both familiar and refreshingly new. When I'm in the studio, since I'm also producing most of the time, I get to, you know, experiment, and I get to vibe. And I get to, you know, write the lyrics, try, try to record some stuff in the booze, and that's the flow of it. I'm a 